We begin in Australia where the new year brings no relief from the catastrophe caused by bushfires. Across parts of the country's east coast, there are scenes like this. Homes and businesses reduced to charred rubble after fast-moving fires tore toward the coastline. Australian authorities estimate around 4,000 people are trapped on a beach in Malakuta by a fast-moving fire. Residents of this resort town in the state of Victoria say the smoke was so thick it blocked out the sun and turned oh the morning God. sky pitch black. Scores of fires are burning out of control across Australia amid a heat wave which has seen temperatures exceed 40 Celsius in every state. The biggest blazes are raging in New South Wales, where two mega blazes have now encircled the country's most populated city, Sydney. Have you ever seen conditions as bad as this before? The South Coast alight. <laughs> Exploding gas bottles blowing apart a home on the outskirts of Batemans Bay almost looking like a nuclear bomb as it incinerated the forest, a tiny dose of water turning into a steam. Fires burning at an emergency level. The beach became a fallout shelter, scared residents lined up like ants across the sand as they watched the inferno roll towards them. Bringing with it new potential victims, this a battle on the outskirts of Nowra. When you have a wind shift of 180 degrees, that is a big problem. On a day of devastation, the early signs were ominous. Residents waking to a real life nightmare. This was Bermagui at 9am. As an eerie darkness descended, at Batemans Bay, the beach, usually filled with summer revelers, became a makeshift evacuation point. Thousands seeking shelter. Yeah, a lot of explosions. Turning Earth into Mars, it really was a scene from another world. In the town centre, the power went out, daylight disappearing from the streetscape. It just went black, just like that, just the whole sky. The fire sent a rapidly rising column of hot air into the atmosphere, which created its own weather system in the form of a cloud. But that cloud became unstable and collapsed, causing erratic behaviour at the foot of the fire. This freakish weather event that would have to be seen to be believed engulfed that vehicle with flame, fire and strong winds and literally picked up an eight-ton truck and flipped it over. 